Inside suite number three, the Hannigan at Glendelia Boutique Hotel and Culinary Studio in Cincinnati, actually in the historic district known as Glendale. It's so fun, too, to walk around outside and see the trains and the cool vintage shops and boutiques. And this little bed and breakfast is a gem. Okay, so I'm going to show you around the hand again, all right? Uh, so we're in the living room, so let's take a peek. What I love about it is like all this vintage uh, and antique furniture. It gives it such a great historic feel. And literally, we're like minutes from I-75. <laughs> you just never would know. Oh, sorry for showing my backside in the mirror there. Uh, and of course, television. We have some modern amenities too. All right, so I'm going to show you um, the bedroom at the Hannigan. This is great. So cozy. So comfortable. Uh, take a peek. Right? How inviting is that? And of course, being the bedroom, um, plenty of closet space for you if you guys are traveling. I'm actually spending three nights here because uh, I'm here in town for the Western uh, and Southern Tennis Championships uh, for the ATP and WTA Tours. Love tennis, can't wait. Um, come every year, but this is the first time staying at Glendale. I happen to find this online, and it's just such a hidden treasure. And of course, plenty of places uh, to put your clothing. Uh, and again, that bed. How comfortable does that look? Oh, cannot wait. Okay, so let's show you the kitchenette because being part of this uh, boutique hotel and culinary studio, uh, there are benefits. Um, by the way, kitchenette, you got a microwave, sink, uh, plenty of stuff up here for you. Oh, if I can get the cabinet doors open. Indeed. Okay, so um, one of the perks about being right upstairs from a culinary studio culinary delights in the mini fridge. Let's go see them. Um, when I checked in, Rachel said, oh, by the way, uh, in the fridge, you're going to see some uh, bread and some quiche and some fresh fruit. All you have to do in the morning is warm it up. You had me at quiche. <laughs> and of course, uh, water and OJ and milk in there too. And because I'm a kid at heart, I noticed their cereal on the counter. I love it. Um, okay, let me show you the bathroom too, because I have to be honest, when I read uh, the description of this place and I heard the term cave shower, they had me at hello and cave shower. Uh, so let's put the lights on. Love this too. I mean, such an antique feel in the bathroom. Love the wallpaper. Look at that. It's so awesome. And then, without further ado, backing into the cave shower. How about this? Let's just give you a 360, shall we? Bear with me, bear with me. This is a great modern amenity um, in a hotel bed and breakfast that really has um, historic flair. But highly recommend the Glendelia Boutique Hotel and Culinary Studio. Uh, if you're in the Cincinnati area and you wanna, you wanna stay somewhere that feels like it's truly outside of the city, and doesn't have the hustle and bustle of downtown Cincinnati. I mean, this is it. That's all I can say. This is it. This place is just incredible. I'm going to try to get over here and just kind of show you uh, the outside. I mean, look at this view. Well, it's going to be really bright. You're not going to be able to see the view, but just trust me when I tell you. It's awesome. It's charming. It's historic. It's in Glendale, Ohio, the historic district of Glendale in Cincinnati. And this is the Glendalea Boutique um, hotel and culinary studio, highly recommend staying here.